Well, as we close up the show this morning, we went ahead back to the kitchen with News 13's Aaron Morgan. Mm, scrambled eggs and bacon? I don't think so. I don't so. think that's on the menu no. this morning. But she, it's, it, it looks like it smells fantastic. It does, does and she's sense? learning a lot. <laughs> Good morning, guys. That's right. It smells so good, and we are getting to the final stages here. But first, I have a joke for everyone. All right, Chef Steven, why did the chef quit his job? Don't answer. Uh, <laughs> I couldn't. I can't imagine why. <laughs> they cut his celery. Oh, <laughs> yeah, good one. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, we are gonna taste the smelling soup that we've been making all morning long, and we'll see how it, it tastes. All right. All right. Let's, let's see. I'm kind of scared it's going to be hot. Ladies first. All right. All right. You grab yours. Okay. All right. I'm dripping everywhere. It's okay. All right. No, no, don't. <laughs> You're there. not supposed to do that. I just <laughs> learned that. But it's okay. I'm taking it home for me. Yeah, so it's fine. Right. It's fine. True. All right. I'll finish it off. I think it needs just a little bit of this crushed red pepper. We I think like it a little needs, kick. I what think do you it think it needs? Some lemon. I, I agree. Yeah, I definitely it. needs some lemon. And I learned how to zest a lemon. Oh, yes, you did. Yes, here yes. today at Gulf Coast <laughs> State College. And that's uh, one thing that you guys learned how to do here is zest a lemon? Yes. All right. It's part of the program. All right, we'll switch roles here and you can okay. hold on to that. All right. So I'm putting it on top of this, right? Yes. This, this way. Yes. All right. Put it on top like that. You guys are gonna see me do this. This lemon adds a little bit of kick. More? I would need yeah, one more. All right, one more time. There it is. I think that little zesty lemon. All right. Switch, Switch back, back with you. All right. Let's. Is this one thing that you do with the students? Is kind of let them taste and see what they need to add and. Absolutely. Uh, following directions following recipes today's recipe we kind of made up as we went along but it was let's see, let's see what we got now all right taste it one more I think time we're, i think we're almost there oh yes is that it? it's delicious so i have to use a different spoon to try it yes okay i got it i'm also <laughs> learning sanitary rules here because i i'm a double dipper for sure <laughs> if we were making this in a, in a restaurant then we wouldn't double dip but that's good all right, I think I've got lunch for everyone today. Very nice. All right. Thank you for your help. Yep. And one more time, just tell everyone what this dish is and how it, you know, is good for the holidays. This is just a, a creamy potato garlic soup. Uh, we learned and, and use our base mirepoix. Um, that mirepoix can be used in your stuffing, um, in some stews, some nice cold weather dishes. Uh, certainly a, a good fundamental base flavor um, for your dishes. Moving on. If you want to see more, you can check out our YouTube channel at Gulf Coast State College's YouTube. We have Chef's Corner, right. new pizza. And people can enroll, right? Absolutely. En enrollment for the spring semester is open now, and uh, our programs are up and running. Cu culinary and hospitality, please come see us. All right. Sounds so great. We had so much fun here making this soup this morning. It tastes so good, smells so good. Thank you so much, Chef Steven. If you guys want to learn more about Gulf Coast State College's culinary program, we'll have more information on our website, mypanhandle.com. Going to send it back to you guys in the studio.